Hello everyone, this is Sigur, uh, I'm back with a new video and uh, today I want to answer a question which I had under my second video about upload care, uploader in the flow forms and uh, the question was about uh, how can I have like multiple uploaders in one form and uh, today I want to uh, give an answer to that question so we are going to have like we are going to look through how I set up this like to have uh, two upload care uploaders in uh, one form and uh, they submit like different uh, UID and different URL for uh, each file uploaded in uh, in each uploader so uh, first of all uh, this thing is actually uh, written in uh, documentation of uh, upload care. So if you go to uploading, file uploader, data and events, uh, you will go to, you will see like this several uploaders on the same page. And this is how we're going to implement this thing. Uh, however, there, uh, there is like several details which are not mentioned particularly in this section. So uh, I will walk you through these uh, small details so that you could be able to uh, have the, the same setup. And uh, please uh, check out the clonable later uh, because I have it all here. Uh, you can just uh, see how it's done. So uh, first of all, uh, I have this new page here, multiple uploaders, and we go to uh, custom code settings. So the first thing is like we have this uh, config uh, tag here. And uh, this is actually going from this, like from uh, upload the configuration. So we have this uh, config here. And uh, we are going to have two of them. Uh, why? Because we are going to change this parameter. CTX name is basically the context, the context name. And we are going to put it as uploader one and uploader two. So uh, when you copy it from here, just copy one one more again, and uh, uh, you just change this uh, CTX name from my uploader. So it, it actually can be anything, but uh, like in my case, I made it like uploader one, uploader two. You can make it uh, any other name, but uh, it should be like different, two different uh, different configs. Okay, save. Uh, later we go to the uh, to the form. So we go to we have like two HTML embeds now for file one and file two. And uh, we have the same, this like context name, CTX name uh, here inside of uh, uploader. So uh, also when you go to uh, this section, like when you select put on a page, uh, you have a CTX name here. It's also up my uploader by default, the same as the config. So basically we have one config for each uploader. That's why when two of them uh, on the, uh, in the in the first part of the code which I showed before, uh, this is basically what you need to set up. And like on the second one, I have it called uploader two. Okay. And uh, now we're catching the events, right? Like so, we have this code uh, which I made before. So now we have this uh, code. And I modified it in the way that when we get the data, we see what is the uh, what is the context of which uploader, what is the like yeah, context, and we, we, we can define which uploader uh, was used, and then we uh, target different elements. Like so, I have like now UID field one and URL field one, and for uploader two. I have this like if statement, upload the two and the field two, field two, okay? So, and the other stuff is the same, just like you make condition, basically. And uh, we actually already have it published, I guess. So let's see how it actually works. So I go to file one and I choose this plant and I have my UID and I have my URL. And for the file two, I have a different UID and different URL in my fields. So this is basically how it works. Uh, I would notice that since my last video, the, uh, the UI of the upload care changed a little bit and uh, they're making some changes. So I will be following up on these changes. 
But uh, yeah, feel free to go get this uh, clonable, uh, see the setup, uh, copy this code, uh, customize it for you, uh, so that you will make sure that you can set up everything to work just perfectly for your uh, project. And uh, let me know in the comments if you have more questions, uh, clarifications, uh, what do you think about this? Uh, yeah, just let me know. Uh, please give a comment, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Okay, see you. Bye.